Hello, what's up? Uh, how's it going? <laughs> I'm Nick. Uh, this is Nintendo Direct 913 2018. I wanted to start recording a few minutes ago to say some things. It's currently one minute until it starts. Uh, I'm not very set up. Chat is still over here. I don't know why. What if I do this? Uh, oh. You know, this works. So I wanted to start a minute ago to say some things, but whatever. It doesn't matter. I had technical issues because this microphone here, this, it, it's not working, which, you know, that's lovely. So we're using the laptop mic. So that's why the audio sounds like it's on a laptop. Uh, okay, here we go. We're starting. I don't hear it. Okay, I have audio. You guys have audio. It's a, it's a bit loud. So we're going to turn that down. Okay. Let's see what happens. <laughs> I don't know what they're going to talk about. Probably a lot of Smash. This looks like Luigi's Mansion for 3DS. Okay, that is what it is. Not too particularly interested in this. A lot of people. Are... Three, three, three. Hold on. Three. Hello, everyone. I'm Shinya Takahashi, and I'll be your guide for today's Nintendo Direct. As you just saw, we kicked things off with a new reveal. Okay. No, that's cool. That Luigi's next it could have been Animal Crossing, but do you, I don't care. Switch. I was like, that's just the 3DS one, whatever, but... but we'll have to save that for another time. Dude, they now, might announce Animal Crossing. They're not going to, but they might. Nintendo 3DS. Please take a look. The pink puff ball gets crafty again. I'm so happy that the 3DS the 2010 Wii game, Kirby's Epic Yarn Some is people are saying that they're going to reveal Waluigi for Smash, but I think that's just a meme, because I don't think that he's going to be added, because he's already in... From okay, to okay. Obstacles this is a Wii port, I don't care. Is entirely made of um, yarn. Even robots. He's already kind of like, Somehow, confirmed as an assist trophy, so I don't think that they're going to reveal him here. I don't know, I think they're just going to talk about more E3 stuff, return. but obviously there are new reveals, and like this, and Luigi's Mansion 3. Also being popped up with some new so, yeah, we'll just see what happens, I guess. When you pick up items, you can craft bigger yarn balls, or you can even conjure up some wind to rake in the beans. For a little added oh, that's challenge, new. see if you can outrun this speed demon of a devil in devilish mode. To top it off, new minigames will give you a chance Ooh. to play as some other familiar faces. This is Epic Yarn Extra, Epic Yarn or launches exclusively for Nintendo 3DS port. in 2019. It looks like more of a port, but extra things. Dude, they're just rolling. Jr. Oh my gosh. For greatness? Two new things already? Three the new Mushroom things? Kingdom has a okay, well, this is the. Lorbs, and the only ones who they already talked about this. Mario, but... Luigi, and Bowser? Whoa. It can only be Mario, Luigi, Bowser's inside story. There's another side to every story, even this one. Now you can go on Bowser Jr.'s journey as well. In his new adventure, Bowser Jr. sets off to find his own remedy for the Blorps. But thanks to his signature selfishness, he ends up causing more problems than he cures. Better gather some allies and build up your very own army. Create your own formations, support allies with an arsenal of moves, and conquer the chaos in every action-packed battle. Is Bowser Jr. destined for glorious kingship like his papa? Mario & Luigi, Bowser's Inside Story plus Bowser Jr.'s Journey releases on Nintendo 3DS January 11th. Hunt Ghost with Luigi and a second Sorry. player? While you're waiting for the new game on Nintendo Switch, don't forget that the original Luigi's Mansion mm -hmm. is coming to Nintendo 3DS. That comedically spooky vibe that fans remember is intact, even when you're playing the new two-player mode making its debut in the Ooh. Nintendo 3DS version. If you and another player each own the game, one of you can play as this also even greener guy as you explore the mansion together. Or, if only one of you has the game, 
you can still play boss battles together in the gallery using download play on your Nintendo 3DS systems. Okay, so that's oh yeah, how they do it. in Professor Egad's lab, you can tap select amiibo figures to surprising results, like revealing hidden booze or healing Luigi when he talks to Toad. Each of the four compatible amiibo has a different effect. Luigi's Mansion will haunt Nintendo 3DS on October 12th, just in time for Halloween. Mm. Yo-Kai Watch Blasters is out now. All right, this Even is where I tune out and I talk warriors. about something else. So, whether your allegiance is with the Red Cat Corps or the White, I don't know. Squad, they're just really like zooming through things here. I thought that they were gonna primarily talk about Smash, but they obviously series. just had the Smash Direct last month. After launch, so I don't know up. if they're going you to be. How much they're going to be talking about Smash? I assume that they're going to reveal something for it. But I don't really know. I mean, I always hope for Animal Crossing, but at this point, I've kind of just like lost interest. I mean, if they teased it, I'd be excited, but like, I don't know. I feel like Luigi's Mansion 3 was already like the big thing for this direct. Why you ask? But I don't know. I mean, we can always see. Now's the perfect time to become a fan. Yokai Watch Blasters is out now. And Cat don't and forget dog. about the Moon Rabbit Crew update. Oh, and Rabbit. That's all the headlines like for Nintendo Pokemon 3DS. Games. Yay, already done. See, they're already How's like, the system's fucking dead. Well, <laughs> from here, let's focus on Nintendo Switch titles. Yes. Please take a look. It's Inkopolis news time. Version 4? The music is kicking. This is like movie trailer opening. <laughs> Hold up, what's this? Whoa. Damn, they're really going hard on this. So obviously this means no Animal Crossing. <laughs> but this looks interesting. I assume that that comes out tomorrow, right? No. Did they just update it last week? I don't know. I don't follow Splatoon too much. Squid Research Lab. They link to a Tumblr. <laughs> Everyone's favorite blue robot makes his triumphant return in Mega Man 11. That looked cool though, I wanna... Marking the 30th anniversary of the iconic out. series, this brand new game is gunning for greatness on Nintendo Switch. Jump, slide, and shoot through each of the colorful, challenging stages and try to take down a gallery of deadly bosses like the formidable Bounce Man. In timeless fashion, you must defeat the eight robot masters and get each of their special weapons. The technological miracle of the new double gear system makes for a fresh take on the series satisfying platforming action. Move so fast that time slows down around you. Temporarily enhance your weapons and show them who the real boss is when you need to most. Mega Man 11 also supports the Mega Man amiibo figures. You can tap one each day to receive E-Tanks and other useful in-game items. Mega Man 11 will be ready to rock October 2nd. Dude, that's the day before my birthday, no way. Mario Tennis Aces, further refined in new update. Some popular characters uh, are joining I kind of wanted this, but I don't have money, so I didn't get Birdo. it. The sharpshooting specialist, Shy Guy. The proud high flyer, Koopa Paratroopa. 
and the big boss with no racket, Petey Piranha. These Mushroom Kingdom greats can be acquired by playing online, and we'll keep adding more until next June. Oh. There will even be a new mode called Co-op Challenge. It'll let you participate in online co-op missions that are only available for a limited time. Oh, wow. Complete the objectives while these missions are active, and you receive hat. special outfits, characters with alternate oh, he color can get schemes, and more. Oh, that's cool. We'll continue serving up new content for the game in the future. The version 2 update for Mario Tennis Aces will be available September 19th. Oh, that's my friend's birthday. No way. These arcade classics are back in it's action. It's like my best friend's birthday. Oh, wow. Back in the day, Capcom lit up the arcade. There's something right before my birthday. Not something before my, on my best friend's what? birthday. The good old days are back. Final fight. The King of Dragons. I'm yawning. Captain Commando. Knights of the Round. Let me get to some that interests me. And Warriors of Fate are making a comeback. And so are these first-time home console releases. Armored Warriors and Battle Circuit are joining the fight for a total of seven games. If you each have a Joy-Con controller, up to four players can beat them up together. Aspiring Bash Buddies can even take the fight online this time. Pretty soon, you'll be able to play with other Capcom fans from around the world because Capcom Beat 'em Up Bundle will be ready for action on Nintendo eShop September 18th. New Super Mario Bros. U is getting the deluxe treatment, which means it's time to take down Bowser and his Koopaling invasion in the tried-and-true side-scroller headed to Nintendo Switch. Mario, Luigi, and Toad are all here, and if that's not enough, Nabbit and Toadette are joining in the fun as well. They killed Blue Toad! Nabbit doesn't take damage from enemies, which can no. really come in handy. And if Toadette powers up with a super crown, ta-da! She transforms into Peachette. Peachette can double jump, float slowly during free fall, and get a boost back up if she falls into a pit. Luigi's first starring role in a platforming adventure, New Super Luigi U, is getting the deluxe treatment too, and comes free of charge. A single Joy-Con controller is all a player needs, and up to four players can join in together, anytime, anywhere. New Super Damn, Mario bro. Bros. U Deluxe comes down the pipe oh, on that's January a cool 11th. Logo. They killed Blue Toad! Because gender equality. Nintendo Switch is ready to roll. What? That's so... I don't want that. I already own both of those games, but at the same time, I really it can want only that. Be Katamari Damacy, remastered in HD. That naughty king of all cosmos has made a mess, as he does. And now you better take control of the prince here and roll. Just roll and roll all over the place Jesus and all game. over stuff. Why? Until the gradually growing mass towers over buildings. The clump or Katamari you roll will shine on as a beautiful star in the sky. On Nintendo Switch, you can enjoy the game's cool. new gyro controls, HD rumble, and even multiplayer battles by each using a Joy-Con controller. Roll it till you reach the stars anytime, anywhere. Katamari Damacy Reroll will launch Winter 2018. Next, we have some more news for you. We've announced some details about Nintendo's new service called Nintendo Switch Online. Yes, here we go. The launch date. You won't have to wait long. The service will begin September 18th. Yeah, they already put something on Twitter about it. We prepared a video to show you what's offered with your Nintendo Switch Online membership. So please take a look. More games, more features, more fun. Nintendo Switch Online. Allow us to introduce five features included with your membership. Cloud saving! Of course, you can play compatible games together online, even when you're far apart. Compete against players the world over. 
or team up for some great co-op action. There are so many ways to have fun. A variety of games oh, are supported. Guys, did you see that? So find your favorites Game explain. Look at that. Online. Two seconds, if that, of footage. Analyze it, please. You can even play Here classic NES games anytime, anywhere on Nintendo <laughs> Switch. Get lost in the gameplay, whether you're the boss or the little monster. For multiplayer games, each player can grab a Joy-Con controller. So both of you can share in the fun. NES games can also be played online. As they say, playing together long distance makes the heart grow fonder. <laughs> Look forward to a growing library of NES games. I don't need this. Actually. Luigi knows that no matter how careful you try to be, something unexpected can happen. Accidents can cause your precious save data to disappear. Guys, guess what? Homebrew's easier now. But because you can just cloud save way. everything. With Nintendo Switch Online, game save data is automatically so backed up in the cloud. It's okay. Even if your console breaks, your save data will be safe from harm. Nintendo Switch Online also connects with the smartphone app. With this app, you can voice chat with friends while playing certain games. No. No, people just use Discord. Back it's so much players better. can also join in the conversation. That way everyone's having fun. No. The service even has the ability to enhance certain games by connecting with them, like Splatnet 2. Members will also receive special offers. What are they? We'll have more to announce in the future. More games, more features, more fun. Nintendo Whoa. Switch Online. <laughs> I need money. The service begins September 18th. Think about which plan is right for you. If your family has two or more accounts, you can save some money with the family membership. How's it look? Well, we have one more thing we'd like to introduce. This Nintendo Entertainment System style controller works with NES games on Nintendo Switch. This one here is the left NES controller. And this is the right NES controller. We created them so you can play NES games like the ones you saw in the video, just like old school gamers oh, did back in the day. Right. Please enjoy them with Nintendo Entertainment System. Is it because like, it hooks up to the Joy-Con? These controllers wirelessly oh, yeah. connect with Nintendo Switch. And you can charge them by simply attaching oh, them to the console. That's hot. That's cool. We hope you'll enjoy using these controllers to play oh, 60 this bucks. growing library of classic NES no games. Thanks, but that's pretty cool. For more details, because you can probably also Nintendo connect it to your online, computer then. Please check the official Nintendo website. Now, let's get back to some more Nintendo Switch games. All right. Your partner Pokemon oh, here is we amazing. go. I ordered EV. Get ready to set off on a Kanto region adventure with your very own partner Pokemon in Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu and Pokemon Let's Go Eevee. Today, we want to share a couple things that you and your partner can enjoy in the upcoming game. During your adventure, you'll occasionally come across obstacles blocking your path. When you do, you can rely on a secret technique to get past them. Secret techniques are special skills that only your partner Pikachu or Eevee can use in the wild. Use them to chop down trees that stand in your way travel across water or soar into the sky. Furthermore, only your partner Pikachu or Eevee can learn certain powerful moves for use in battle. Plus, if you pet your partner while your Nintendo Switch is in handheld mode, you can change your partner's hairstyle depending yes. on how you use the touch. Oh hell yeah, I'm giving my Pokemon Eevee that swoop there. And Pokemon Let's Go Eevee the swoop is the way to go. 16th, alongside the Pokeball Plus accessory. Also, Look for two new bundles that will ah! include a Nintendo Switch system with Pikachu <gasps> and Eevee style Joy-Con controllers. Ah! One of these two Pokemon adventures. Oh, it's so. Pokeball plus Ooh. accessory. Ooh. 
Oh, that's fucking sexy. Ooh. Burning hells that was like a... On Nintendo Switch. Oh, I want to buy that. Of just course, like... we're talking about Diablo 3. The dark oh. fantasy adventure that may just consume your life both inside and outside the game world. From the high heavens to the burning hells, you'll explore the full story and the deadly world mm -hmm. of Sanctuary. Yawn. For loot filled bounties and rifts to randomize dungeons with even greater spoils. Play as a demon hunter, barbarian, crusader, necromancer, witch doctor, monk, or wizard, with up to three friends online, offline via local co op, or on a single console couch co op style. You can even suit up in this Nintendo Switch exclusive transmog armor fit for the king of evil, Ganondorf. All amiibo figures are compatible, oh, wow. allowing you to summon a group of challenging enemies overflowing with sparkling goodies. Diablo 3 Eternal Collection invades Nintendo Switch on November 2nd. We're making this okay, good. super. I want to see more on this because I pre-ordered this. Types of gameplay on Nintendo Switch. I'm actually so excited. Like I already have plans with like friends. Your body in like on the first day. Or dive into the series' first four-player co-op mode, River Survival. Bet you've never played anything like Toad's Rec Room, which cleverly connects two systems. Yeah, I'm still amazed at that. Of course, the four-player board game mode that fans love is back and full of new features. By rolling character specific say, dice blocks with alternate numberings, you can make a game-changing comeback. You got stuck. Every last no. mini game no is voice brand acting. New. All 80 of them. For a party of one, check out the new single-player modes. You could play through a series of mini games to complete specific tasks on Challenge Road. Compete against players around the world in the online Mario-thon mini game mode and more. Oh. The festivities begin when Super Mario Party launches October 5th. I'm excited for it. It's gonna be good. Because it's going back to like the old story style. In a village with a secret to hide. And online for the first time ever in Mario Game Party Freak history. Game Freak presents a brand new RPG. The story is set in a small village. Under the protection of a great castle, the settlement enjoyed lasting peace. That is, until the sudden appearance of monsters. Indeed. The entire story takes place in this one single village. Take up arms against invading I'm monsters tired. and strategically select from a variety of battle commands. When the situation calls for it, enlist the aid of fellow villagers to surmount powerful threats. What secret does the village harbor? Find out when town releases in 2019. Portland. Develop a city anytime, anywhere. The critically acclaimed city-building game City Skylines is coming to Nintendo Switch. Wow, look at that. Which means there's a city in need of a new mayor. You. And you've got some real moving Animal and crossing. shaking to do if you want to improve quality of life. You see how businesses. that split 2 like update growth. was? There's Whether like investing in roads no and power chance lines, that public facilities. Anymore. I mean, there never was in the first service. place. How the city they hate develops Animal is crossing totally up to you. Reason. You're kind of but a big deal. Still but in like, this game... Sometimes it's the small details that stand out most. You can watch over every single citizen's movements. What's more, both previously released downloadable content packs After Dark and Snowfall are included in the Nintendo Switch version. Flex your mayoral might at home or on the go when City Skylines launches today I don't on know, Nintendo Sim City e just always seemed like... A tale of belief, blood, and steel. The moon has fallen. Now, the world and its inhabitants are on the brink of extinction in Daemon X Machina. As a mercenary, you'll pilot a powered suit called an Arsenal, face down runaway AI. As you defeat enemies during combat, you'll acquire their weapons and parts, which you can equip on the fly. If you haul acquired weapons back to the base, they're added to your personal armory for use in future missions. Each arsenal can be equipped with multiple weapons. By changing between projectile and melee attacks, you can adapt your weaponry to the situation at hand and gain the advantage for your side of the war. At any time during battle, you can exit your arsenal to explore the field on foot. Hmm. You can make enhancements to strengthen your Reminds me of Titanfall, and your arsenal's abilities will be augmented as well. 
Up to four Damn, players can join forces in an online co-op to take down massive bosses. Who is a second one? But I doubt that many people still play it. Damon X Machina launches in 2019. A big adventure in a miniature world of crafts. Hey, first time they've mentioned this in like a year. Oh, world made of stuff like boxes that is cool. And paper cups, I think that they haven't talked about this since E3 2017. And hustle on by. Many unusual obstacles litter the landscape. At first, I was kind of like, I don't want this, but now I'm kind of like, I want this. Because Yoshi's Woolly World on the Wii U, I like love hate relationship with the game so much. Because I decided to 100% it. Oh my god, it's so fucking hard sometimes. It's a Yoshi game, but Yoshi games are so hard. Wait, what? You can play the course backwards? Guess a change in outlook really can show you a whole different side of the world. The flip side. Oh. See, that's gonna be so annoying. But I kinda want this game. It's so cute. One and two. It's like a lot of fun. <laughs> Look at that. Oh my god. Are they finally gonna give us a date? Yoshi's Crafted World releases in spring 2019. Crafted World, not your only world. Spring 2019, but that can mean is a perfect so much. Fit for Nintendo Switch. <laughs> and to prove it, Asmodee Digital, a leader yeah, in card and board games, is bringing full adaptations to that game. of best-selling tabletop but, games to the system. Yeah. Build a medieval world in a full adaptation of the award-winning Carcassonne, complete with 3D maps, solo mode, four-player local multiplayer, and the game's famous expansions available as paid DLC. Whether neat. you play alone or alongside a second player, forge a powerful deck and a fellowship of three to face the forces of Sauron in each story-driven quest of the Lord of the Rings, the living card game. Stop the spread of four diseases and cure them all on your own or in local four-player multiplayer with Pandemic. Plus, it's individually priced DLC based on popular expansions. Thanks to Asmodee, this is just the beginning for tabletop gaming on Nintendo Switch. In addition to these titles, we can also confirm that even more is on the way, including one of the most popular board games ever, Catan. Catan. Ooh. And a dungeon crawler based on Steve Jackson's iconic card game, Munchkin. Stay tuned. I was gonna say, I was gonna be like, I wonder if they could put Catan All on the great Switch. Creations, even nations begin right before with a that, spark. and then they did. Empire in the palm of your hands and turn friends into the power elite with exclusive four player local multiplayer. I'm not bored, I swear. When Civilization 6 ushers in a new world on Nintendo Switch November 16th. At Civ Game. Don't get too cocky, Star Fox. Playtime is over in Starlink. This interplanetary adventure will push you and Fox McCloud to your limits. Let's be honest here. You guys need all the help you can get. Peppy, Falco, and Slippy yeah. will provide much needed backup in the new Nintendo Switch exclusive missions found only in Starlink Battle for Atlas. Star Fox, form up on me. Falco here, I got you covered. It's time to lock on, do a barrel roll, and save the Atlas star system, no matter who threatens to stop you. I'm not going to sleep, I swear. and match parts on your own R-Wing when Starlink Battle for Atlas takes flight October 16th. So nothing on Smash or... 
two more great RPGs are mm -hmm. coming to Nintendo I don't know, I guess maybe they're keeping Smash the and Nintendo NBA Direct Final separate. An so since they just had a Smash Direct, there's going to be day. nothing in Nintendo Direct. And then the next Direct will probably be another so big really Smash have Direct. To to escape the area I don't know. Or, face or they're just waiting until the very end to like drop well. Waluigi. So will the Reaper, just kidding. Because he's not going to be in World Smash. With you. Final Remix launches October 12th. But maybe they're just waiting until the very end to talk about it. Guide a group of legendary warriors on a journey through the tragic history that do You know, I got Xenoblade Chronicles too. I like barely events. played through it, and I don't know, I just wasn't game. that interested. You didn't get all the hype. I like really wanted it, and I was like super system. excited that I got Allowing it. I got it for Christmas. I was like super happy. And, their masters, the and I didn't even play it for that long, and then I was just kind of like, I don't know. When Chronicles 2 Torna, the Golden like, Country eh. launches September 21st. Owners of the Xenoblade Chronicles 2 expansion pass can download all the this new content tomorrow. That's a week early. No, no, maybe I should have played more into There's it. There's tons in store on Nintendo Switch, and even more in store for the future. Join more than 38 million players for free-to-play co-op space ninja action when oh, that's Warframe cool. launches I see, like, all my 20th. Steam friends playing this game. Get down to Camila Cabello, Bruno Mars, Cardi B, and more anytime, Cardi anywhere B? in Just Dance 2019. Yo, she's not Nintendo-friendly. FIFA 19 is fast approaching, and you can pre Purchase it on Nintendo eShop tomorrow, so you won't miss the ball when it launches September 28th. Yay. Speaking of fast, race as a team and win as a team in Team Sonic Racing, launching this winter. The highest rated basketball nice. simulation franchise is back. NBA 2K19 is available now on Nintendo Switch. Reese's Puffs! And get ready to jam in the sequel to the smash hit NBA arcade oh, yeah. game, NBA 2K Playgrounds 2. Coming this fall. Play as the Joker, Harley, Lex Luthor, and the rest oh, of the kind of worst in the all new Lego DC Super Villains on October 16th. Where is it? Wow. Final Fantasy comes to Nintendo Switch. Koopo! I've never played a Final Fantasy game either. 15 years after its debut. The co-op action RPG Final Fantasy Crystal Chronicles is being remastered for Nintendo Switch. With the new online multiplayer mode, you and your friends can connect and adventure together. No link cable required. On top of that, there are new areas inside dungeons, so even returning fans can explore the unknown. Final Fantasy Crystal Chronicles Remastered Edition will launch in 2019. Way before then, players can experience the entire world and story of the latest entry in the core series. That's right. Final Fantasy XV Pocket Edition HD launches later today on Nintendo eShop at an introductory price. A leveled up version of World of Final Fantasy is also on the way. This title includes a new feature called Avatar Change which allows you to transform into legendary characters from across the series' storied history. Many fan favorites will show up in the world of Final Fantasy Maxima when it releases on November 6th. In addition, more Chocobo's Dungeon is on the way. 2007's Final Fantasy Fables Chocobo's Dungeon returns in superior fashion. Now, you can befriend all that the monsters. That text is Japanese. Also, by sharing Joy-Con controllers, you can play cooperatively as well. Chocobo's Mystery Dungeon, Everybody, launches this winter. Yay. Final Fantasy XII is coming to a Nintendo system for the first time. Its real-time battle system is a standout in the series, offering the ultimate in both freedom and strategy. This remaster nice. comes loaded with a host of extra features, including a speed mode that lets you pick up the pace of your adventure. There's <laughs> much to discover in the expansive world of evilness. And now you can explore it on the couch or expansive on the Expansive world of evilness. Final Fantasy XII, The Zodiac Age launches in 2019. Which reminds me. Later on, you'll also be able to enjoy these other classics. And their iconic scenes, anytime anywhere Final Fantasy 7 9 and 10 102 HD remaster are coming to Nintendo Switch in 2019
I feel like that's like for Final Fantasy people, it's like a really big yay. Here's a bundle for the but, ultimate fan. Okay, here we go. If you love the Super Smash Brothers series, check this thing out. Is it like a Switch bump? Okay. So I'm not getting that because I already own a Switch, but... Oh! A hardware bundle for Super Smash Brothers Ultimate is on the way. Oh! This specially designed dock features fighters from the original Super Smash Bros. Oh, that's game. sexy. And of course, I like the Pokemon one more though. A download code for Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. There's no better way to show your love for the game. And the set also packs in something you'll want to get your hands on. Joy-Cons. Okay, nice pun. The... That's Joy fucking lame. A new design as well. No, that's this lamer than the Neon one. This is cooler than that. I'm not gonna lie. That's lame. That's weak. I was expecting, like, Nintendo Switch. something big. That's all they talk about for Smash, and it's lame? Going well? Thank you all for watching. We have a bit more to show you. So, Animal Cross. No, what's it gonna be? I assume there's gonna be something about Smash. Last time they did this, it was Smash. Yes! 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 Hold on. Is it Animal Crossing Switch? Please! Is this like official? Animal Crossing Switch? Or is this... <laughs> Fucking did it! Yes! You can't say this, man. Wait. What is this? Please be like a canon game. Please be Animal Crossing Switch. Not just... No, I'm not crying tears of joy. You're fucking gay. Fuck you. <laughs> oh. Okay, I got way too excited. No, I can't afford my reaction or else people are gonna call me gay. Just kidding. Isabelle and Smash, that's fucking hype! Guys, that's... Oh. I mean, I knew that this was gonna happen. I was expecting a character... I wasn't expecting this, though. Oh. Oh. Okay. Guys, that tease... Is Tom Nook also in Smash? Is he depressed that he's not in Smash? Aww. Okay. <laughs> Camping and smashing <laughs> Top kick Was that supposed to be a hint at? Yes! Actually now! Yes! Yes! Oh my god! Ah! They showed, like, nothing! But still! Ah! We have confirmation! <laughs> Uh, 
guys. Guys, we actually have confirmation for Animal Crossing. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh. oh! 2019! Okay. Okay. I freaked out way more <laughs> the first time because I thought that that was them announcing Animal Crossing and then it was like Isabelle's in Smash and then Tom Nook thing and I was like, is this... And then I got faked out. I was like, okay, and Tom looks in Smash 2. I don't give a fuck. But then it was Animal Crossing, and my reaction wasn't even that good. But, oh my god! Yes! Oh. I'm so fucking happy. I have so much work to do right now. <laughs> but, oh my god! They did it! Guys, Animal Crossing for Nintendo Switch 2019, and that means from here on out, there's only going to be more info about it. Oh my gosh, I'm literally going to throw this chair. Oh, they fucking did it. They fucking did it. Oh my gosh. I'm like actually like, oh. Oh my gosh. Guys, I have like a, a, like a good reaction video now. It's not just me falling asleep watching the Nintendo Direct. I mean, that's what it was. Dude, I thought, I was like, they, oh my god. They got my hopes up so much. Like, I thought E3 2017. E3 2017 was the first time that I thought Animal Crossing for Switch. And they didn't do it. And I was like, okay, whatever. It's early in the Switch's life anyway. It's just been out for three months. Okay, they're going to announce it E3 2018. E3 2018 comes by. Nothing. Nothing at all. Okay, this Direct, I was like, you know, it's random. They're probably not going to announce Animal Crossing. But they just dropped Smash like it was fucking nothing earlier. They were like, hey, here's a Direct with, like, some games. Oh, by the way, Smash. So I was like, maybe Animal Crossing. Maybe. But then Luigi's Mansion 3, I was, I, I didn't really think Animal Crossing. I was like, maybe, you know, kind of was like a meme, but no. No, they actually did it. They actually dropped Animal Crossing for Nintendo Switch 2019. Oh my god. Oh my god. Guys, I'm actually gonna fucking die. Please. When, when is 2019? Hey Alexa, how many days until 2019? Guys, that's so many days! 110! Okay. You know, it's alright though. It's alright. <laughs> and that, I mean, it doesn't come out on January 1st, 2019. It'll come out sometime January. Not January. Sometime 2019. Like, literally, for all I know, it still could be over a year until we get it. It could be September 14th, 2019. But it could be January 2019. I don't know. But I, I have good things now to think about. Fuck. <laughs> they announced Animal Crossing. They announced Animal Crossing. They announced Animal Crossing. If you like this video, like Izzle, sub Scrizzle, Tom Dizzle, fucking pre order Animal Crossing Izzle. Let's go!